hi and welcome back so today I thought I would share my setup of my mini daisy dory from Coco Daisy if you have uh, watched my setup videos before you might be used to me uh, posting process videos but due to technical difficulties uh, <laughs> we had or I had to change the plan a bit so let me know down in the comments what you think if you think that uh, this works or if you would rather see my process videos I really enjoy making my process videos so that's not the problem um, anyways I'm go I have to show you I was even for once a bit organized you know <laughs> having sketched out what I was going to have on which page and everything and then and this is kind of embarrassing I thought that I had pressed play uh, record but I hadn't so that happens I have half of it is filmed and the rest is just in my memory so let's stay into it uh, I haven't decorated my covers much I moved back into my pocket molden after using a pi pink filofax for the summer so and those pockets are a bit easier to decorate or I find them easier to decorate than the these molden pockets I did put this uh, paper clip from uh, the Lollipop Box Club in because I think it's cute So, and I thought it fit here a bit of color and these page flags have been here forever they are from a kit last year sometime I don't remember which kit but they've been there for ages and ages as you can see I have not decorated my cover yet there will be a process video on that later on um, and then I have continued to do my goals on the first page I really really enjoy that and I still divide them into life work and other so I have a couple of goals for each section uh, I will sit down to do that later on and Simon is keeping track of my goals and then I have my budget tracker and it's really the simplest of <laughs> budget trackers so it's what's due what what kind of bills I have uh, what income I have and then my savings for the month and here I just make a little I cal I calculate uh, how much will be left after everything is paid and saved and all of that so and then because uh, last my month I changed uh, my weeks up a bit so I don't have a week at a glance and I kind of miss that so here I thought that I would have uh, all of my weeks at a glance and then I would do sort of like to-do lists which is why I put to do there so I will see how that works out and that's why I put this also from the lollipop box club um, I thought it was fitting so it's a little house so all of the house chores goes in here uh, and I hope I can get things a bit more organized and then my week starts so here I have a little bookmark there will also be a process video up on that uh, the paper clip is just made out of the ribbon that came in the scrapbooking kit and uh, I used one of the paper clips that uh, were in the pack for the puffy top stickers the puffy toppers well yeah uh, I used one of those paper clips um, but the whole process will be up shortly uh, and then um, as some of you may know uh, last month I tried to get a bit more space for each day so Monday through Thursday have half a page each 
so I just split them in the middle um, because that makes more sense to me somehow um, and I use washi, I use stamps, I think this one was very cute and then Friday, Saturday and Sunday get one page, one page each so yeah this way I have a bit more space to decorate, I have a bit more space, I can have both lists and I can have uh, what events we do or just plain stick rates. <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. And those weekdays they are from um, a Swedish Etsy shop called Ninja Washi. I will link down to her down below. Uh, and the number stickers are from the planner add-on. And these watches strips, or the one, the uh, beige one, uh, tan, I don't know. Uh, it's from the Day in the Life kit. They had like a sheet of uh, washi tape strips. Oh, here it is, I can show you. This, as you can see, I've already actually used quite a lot of these uh, in the month. August hasn't even begun yet, so I'm very proud of myself. <laughs> but I really like those. They are very. They sit where you have put them. They are very um, nice quality. And that's just a piece of washi tape from Pebbles, I think. And then this stamp was from. I think it's from the Day in the Life kit or one of these stamp sets from the scrapbooking or day in life kit I really can't remember uh, and then I've just played around with the placing of things so far I haven't really used the pages to plan and then this page I think this is one of the few spreads that haven't been used at all so far and I will probably we just use it for um, I don't know memory keeping or something just you know place a photo and write a few words and then it's done or just have it as is I think it's very pretty and then we have my meal planning section as you can see I have bought the acetate add-on and I have just put a piece of washi tape on the side to make a little page of it and then I have placed a bunch of uh, pages from the notepad and I will use a bit of washi tape in the middle as well but as I'm not sure if I want to take the staples out and uh, change the, the cover out or if I'm just going to decorate the cover I haven't decided that yet I will see when I set or when I when I start to do it if what I'm going to do so but I think it's very convenient to have a stack of the pages here because then I can when I decide what we're going to have when I have put down my ideas and I'm like yeah we're going to have that that and that uh, I can make a grocery list and then I can just rip it out and use it whenever I go shopping and then I also used a paper clip here because I think it's neat to find it easily and because I really like that ladybug. And then we have the month at a glance. Um, and as usual, I used the back of one of the daily to do pages, daily pages. Um, and I just used my pens and uh, draw it out um, and just cut it out and then there you go it takes a couple of minutes and then I have a month at a glance because I know a lot of people that's the one big difference between the mini dory and the personal and standard size dory that we don't get a month at a glance in the beginning of the dory we get these uh, uh, striped page pages instead. I know that people use these to to uh, make weekly monthly overviews as well because if you count 
there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stripes. So you could easily turn it into a um, into a monthly monthly glance if you would want to, but I prefer to do it this way. So that's just personal preference. And then I used a couple of uh, because this one I didn't cut this one out beforehand. I just f cut it around the edges, sort of, and. I was left with a couple of strips of that acetate, so I thought it would be pretty to divide some of the pages with. So that's what I did there. And then I, here I've used uh, a sticker from the planner add-on. And as you can see, unfortunately, the ants on the other page bled through a bit, but I can just cover it up with a couple of uh, stickers or I can just easily uh, stamp a couple of uh, ants on this side of the page as well I don't know if you can see it I, perhaps I, if you look closely there's like some bleed through or shadowing I guess is the right word um, so yeah because I made these awesome ants which is oh yeah um, I really like these, the that stamp, um, and then here we have some of the washi strips. And as I didn't have enough weekdays, it was just four weeks of worth of uh, weekdays. I had to be creative, so I used the letter stickers from the planner add-on and I actually think this is one of my favorite spreads so I think it turned out uh, quite nicely. I really like that dark brown together with this bright yellow. As I said in my unboxing I think this this kit is a perfect transition from from summer to autumn. You know you still have those warm summery days but uh, the nights will get chillier and, you know, last days of summer, for me at least. And then this is the last uh, empty spread and I will, as I said on the other spread, I will probably just slap some photos in or something. Or just, you know, doodle or just leave it as is because I think it's really, really pretty uh, anyways. So that's that and then... Uh, I have used a paper clip and this is also something I like to do. Uh, so I used a paper clip to clip uh, the current month together with the front cover. Uh, and then I usually, this one isn't glued, so this one I just change out every month. Uh, so that way, I don't know. I think it's fun to change it out a bit because as you can see the cover isn't very nice. It's been used. So I like to do that and then it's very easy to find the current month uh, and this one I use uh, mainly to pre-plan so um, but I do the decorating of this uh, this spread I do when I set my month up or actually when I get the kits because <laughs> what I usually do is I take the weekdays that came in the planner add-on and I put them on top of each week uh, and this month I tried to not, because if I put them up here, they cover up the dates and I thought that it would be cuter to just have them uh, at the bottom of those squares instead. And I actually think it worked out quite well. And then I've used a couple of uh, washi tape strips and those stickers and uh, these alphas are from Freckled Fawn as well as this piece of wash as well, which is a new subscription that I've started. This is the first kit I have from them and I really love them. Uh, I think they complement the Coco Daisy kit very well. And then lastly I have a blank insert and as you can see I haven't even started using this. I think it's so cute, it's from 15 Prill and she has loads of super cute stickers. Um, and this was a freebie of hers 
and I thought it could be fun if I just want to jot something down or if I just want to doodle or you know just want to if I'm talking on the phone I just can you know scribble or whatnot so this has no purpose it's just it's there if I need it <laughs> so that's that and I have placed uh, one of uh, the paper clips here as well this one was in I don't remember if it's was from the uh, planner add-on or the planner planner main kit but I thought it was pretty and I thought it worked best there and I have placed I have used the charm from the kit I have a couple of charms here so this blue one is from the planner main kit this one I got from a friend and that little coffee pot is from the lollipop box club and I thought they worked very well together so that's my setup for the month and oh. <laughs> So that's the setup for the month and uh, please let me know down in the comments if it worked like this or if you would rather see me do uh, the usual get messy with stickers and stamps and inks and whatnot then I would be happy to do that as well and I will try to re remember to hit that record button. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I hope I will get back to you soon. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.